Hi everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Tarot. I hope you were all well. If you're new to our little channel, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. We're going to throw down some cards for Cancer real quick for the second half of April. I got about a half hour to get this one done. And then my son has to start his online schooling today. So I have to give up the Chromebook for a few hours. Because his tablet went crash, bang, boom onto the floor the other day and I can't take it to Best Buy to get it replaced right now so I have to give up some of my work stuff for a little while every day anywho this reading will be for Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus if it resonates with you, cool it is your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given to you by the cards if you choose to do anything at all it is your journey, not mine I just read the cards and if it doesn't resonate which it's a general reading it might not resonate with every Cancer that's fine. Throw it out. Forget you ever saw it. it. Doesn't apply to you. Or check your moon rising or Venus sign readings as they come out. Maybe those will resonate a little bit better. Just keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. And all things can and maybe vice versa and play out from the perspective of the cross watcher. And if you're a cross watcher popping in, you're welcome here too. Okay, get a little bit more cancer energy into the cards and get this started. Okay. Oh my goodness. Cancer, why are you here? Ace of Cups. That's promising. Maybe you're starting something new. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Four of Swords. Maybe they're... You feel like they're in rest mode? Maybe they're just coming out of a situation where they got feelings hurt and they're just taking a break. What do you think of them? Knight of Swords. Ooh. They're a good communicator. Maybe you think they might be, I don't know, taking a peek at your social media. Do they know a little bit too much about you? Who do you want from them? Justice in the reverse, huh? Maybe things are a little bit out of balance right now. You want them to balance out. How do they feel about you? Hanged man reversed. They're a little bit stuck. Maybe they're stuck on you. Maybe they're stuck on something else. What do you think of them? Sorry, what do they think of you? Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. Oy. Dead house plants. Not much to offer, offer small. Maybe they think you're still watering a dead house plant. Hmm. What do they want from you? Oh, well. There's the other nine cups plus one right there. And it's coming together for me now. What's the challenge? Five of Pentacles. Being left out in the cold. What 
It needs to be done. The full reversed. Maybe there's no trust. Maybe someone's being childish. Maybe someone's afraid to take a leap. Outcome. Ace of Swords reversed. No communication. All right, let's get some clarity. Let me clarify with the steampunk deck today. Cancer, please don't be a butt kicker like Gemini was. I fought that one for days. Reading for cancer. What's up? School. Yeah, at 10. It's 9 10. <laughs> After this one, we'll get you ready for school, okay? Can you please give me some chicken? Yeah, in a minute. I will be right there. Okay. I love you. If I knew how to pause this thing, I'd go get it for him right now. He'll be fine, trust me. Okay. Hmm. Might be a Virgo you're dealing with. I also have Aries, Pisces, and Libra on the board. Got a little bit of everything. Except there's no fire on the board yet. Except for this. Where'd it go? Where'd it go? The full card represents Aries. But hmm. hmm, a new start after a healing, possibly. Why is the four swords here? Three of Pentacles in the reverse. <sighs> Cancer, you may feel like you need a break from them. It's possibly they're the one who broke your heart. And you just need to mentally rest. Because it just couldn't come together. Three of Pentacles in the reverse. The foundation couldn't be laid. Maybe possibly someone wasn't ready. Why is the Knight of Swords here? Hi. Queen of Cups reversed. Emotionally closed off. <sighs> Communication. Maybe you think things were moving a little fast or emotionally closed. I need one more on that. The 
tower. Okay. Things crashing down. You may have saw something on the social media that you didn't want to see or vice versa. Cause it to come tumbling down. Why is justice reversed here? Judgment. Things are out of balance. I keep hearing it's not fair. It's not fair. There's an ending. Closing out of a cycle. You may have had to make a very difficult judgment call, or they did, because something wasn't right, something was out of balance. There was no foundation. It was shaky. Why is the hanged man here? Let's peek over into their energy for a second. Why is the hanged man here? Why is the hanged man reversed here? Okay. Wheel of Fortune. They're stuck emotionally after something came to an end. One more. You know, with endings come new beginnings. Something drop? No, maybe not. Page of Wands, Ace of Wands. And now the wands come flying out. Okay. They have very strong feelings of another nature for you. Four of wands reversed, but was shaky and the foundation wasn't properly laid I feel like that door is closing they possibly wanted a faster forward movement than you did or than you could handle because you were in rest mode things shook up the tower came tumbling down things came to an end why is the Ace of Pentacles reversed here? Three of Swords, Seven of Pentacles reversed. Someone be grew impatient, overwatered it. They feel like you overwatered it. They think you overwatered it. Or possibly they overwatered it. There's heartbreak here. Somebody couldn't give the time. Things weren't balanced. Things weren't equal. Things were shaky. Somebody wanted more than the other one. Why is the Ten of Cups here? Four of Cups.
Emperor. Oh my goodness. Ten of Cups again. Cancer. They want you. They want the happy ending with you. They want you to take the darn cup. They want you to take the darn cup. They understand if there's something you're healing from. They understand. It may be too fast and you just need to rest. But they're heartbroken. I got two, ten, two tens of cups laying here. The Emperor, yeah, he's a little overbearing. And yeah, he's a control freak. And he always has to have his way. But he's going to take care of you. He wants to take care of you. He wants to be large and in charge. He, she, it, whatever. He's a protector. Another Aries card. You could well be dealing with an Aries. Would I recommend a Cancer and Aries getting together? No, but... Nothing against Aries. They're my fire sign brothers and sisters. I've dated Aries. I have family members and friends who are Aries. And Cardinal Fire. I'm trying to think. Yeah, Cardinal Fire, Cardinal Water. It could be volatile. It could be very volatile. The water is always trying to put out the fire, and the fire is always trying to steam up the water. You see where I'm getting with that? Could be magical, could be volatile. It's your journey, not mine. That could be fun. Anyway, why is the Five of Pentacles here? Thanks. King of Cups reversed. Someone's out in the cold because someone is emotionally closed off. Page of Pentacles. It's slow moving. Small offers of stability slow moving somebody wants this really 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 bad and the other party is like eh, I've gone through some crap I've had too much shake up I'm still processing the ending of something else I don't want it right now Why is the full reverse here for what needs to be done? Queen of Swords. The honest conversation. She can be icy, but she doesn't have to be. You can be honest without being cold. If the Queen of Swords does anything... She's honest. And until you set her off, she maintains her composure. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Neediness and vulnerability. I think an honest conversation needs to take place here before anybody takes a leap. For anybody jumps into anything or jumps away from anything, someone has trust issues because of what they've been through before. Empress popped out. Emperor and the Empress.
That's awesome. Y'all want this to grow. Y'all want this to happen. Somebody needs to give the other person time. Don't push. Have the honest conversation. And this could have the potential to grow. I like it. Why is the Ace of Swords reversed here for the outcome? I think this is the outcome if you don't listen. If you don't heed the warning. Two of Pentacles reversed, you end up just juggling those emotions. Nobody's talking. One more on that. I dropped you. You didn't fall out. Three of Wands. And someone waits. Yeah, let's get some advice. Six of Swords reversed, Five of Cups reversed. Until the return can happen, somebody has to get through their state of sadness. One more on that. Emperor reversed, Queen of Pentacles reversed. Well, vulnerability. Vulnerability. It's okay to admit that you're vulnerable. It is okay to express that you need something, whether it's time, whether it's for things to slow down. It's okay to admit that you need time. Don't completely close yourself off. Just say, hey, I need a minute. I'm not ready. And it's okay to not be ready. Don't ever jump into anything before you're ready. Because then you just repeat the same lesson over and over and over again. Some of you may have, you know, just over and over again, feel like you're getting into the same relationship with a different person. It's because you keep repeating the same pattern. You have to break the pattern. You have to break the pattern. Five of Pentacles, Two of Cups. At some point, you can come out of the cold and do a beautiful connection. Nine of Cups, Strength Reversed. Fill your own cups. You have to figure out how to fill your own cup. If you don't fill your own cup with positive things, it's just going to continue to drain you. Relationships can become draining. You have to be emotionally independent of yourself and be okay being by yourself before you can function in a relationship. That's the bottom line. It's just going to keep shaking up and towers are going to keep falling and the foundation isn't going to be laid solid and stable if you jump into relationships before you heal. You just keep repeating the same pattern over and over. Really annoying, isn't it? I know. You're like, preach, sister, preach! I know. I know. I know. I get it. Cancer, I love you guys. You guys are amazing. Okay. I gotta go get my kid ready for school. So, well, online classes. Anyway, he's gonna have my Chromebook for a few hours. So I'm gonna stop. And when I come back for the afternoon, I'll knock out a couple more second half of April readings and hopefully and I know I'm already a couple of days late but I'm feeling pretty good today I can have everything at least 
uploaded for view by Saturday night and either tonight being Thursday night or tomorrow morning I'm going to do the weekend top and bottom reading so yeah okay much luck be blessed let me know what happens thanks for stopping by love you to bits catch you next time